Ang programang ito ay rated SPG. Striktong patnubay at gabay ng magulang ang kailangan. Maaaring may masiselang tema, lengguahe, karahasan, sexual, horror, o droga na hindi angkop sa mga bata. Hello everyone! Thank you for tuning in to my channel. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And those who have, salama! Salama, salama, salama po! Almost paradise. We start off today. We have Alex and Ernesto. They're going down or going downtown to where there's food marts in Cebu to Bioni, Bioni restaurant. And they're noticing that a lot of these restaurants are being closed. Because there's been a couple of thugs going in there beating up everybody and they're leaving fear of, you know, the of getting killed, you know, so when Mr. Bioni serves Alex, he serves him some soup and then he didn't really like the soup and then he brought out he brought out some hard boiled eggs and he's like, Oh hard boiled eggs, I can eat this and I knew it was gonna happen. I knew it was gonna end up being balloon. He cracks it open, takes a bite, here's the crunch, he's like What's the crunch? He's all, oh, that's blue. That is little chicken uh, or duck fetus, fetuses and legs. So he's, he's going to the bathroom. He's like washing his face and like, you know, almost getting ready to get sick. And one of the thugs come up outside the building and starts beating up Bioni. And uh, Alex sees it, so he beats up the guy. The next thing you know, you know, uh, the guy comes back with two two other thugs and they burn at nighttime. They beat up Bioni and they burn his they burn his uh his restaurant down. So Ernesto and Alex they end up catching this guy that he beat up earlier and you know they they tell him, you know, we know you did this. We're gonna send you away for a long time. So he's like, I can't tell you who's behind this because they'll kill me. So the next day, Ernest, or, or Ernesto goes in like he's opening up a, a pig, you know, selling leeching. So two thugs come up and, you know, they're like, we're going to, you know, you need to leave or we're going to, you know, beat you up, you know, showing him the gun. And Alex, he's going under another name like he's a Spaniard. He's like, I'm his backup man, you know, I run this town. So they end up beating up the two thugs and then they want to know who his boss is. So they're, they're, they got the, the one guy tied up and they're going to lynch him. They're like, oh, well, cook him well done. <laughs> so they tell him who it is. They say, Paul Montrose, he's the one, you know, that's behind all this. <coughs> so he set up a meeting with Paul Montrose. And uh, Alex pretends like, you know, he's setting up an election. He can fix an election so his guy will win so they can uh, set up and they can dump all this trash in Cebu. So they rig it. They don't know. They got the camera of this, this guy, Mr. Montrose, walking in with fake ballots. So they're, they're saying, you're going to leave the country and never come back. Or... Well, it'll send you to jail and you never know. Someone might take you out in jail or maybe your lawyers will get you out, but I would leave. He goes back. They leave him, Miss Montrose. He goes into the governor and the governor already knows this. She plays along and they set up an illegal transfer for money and everything else. So this guy's going to, you know, he's going to get life if, you know, if he doesn't, you know. So... They get rid of the guy and the company that he's all, I'll, I'll send you the wire transfer from the company I work for. So they track that in. So now that company can't go into the Philippines at all. This guy's booted out of the Philippines. It's a good show. And Bioni, they open up his restaurant again. So he's back on and so is all the other uh, little street food restaurants. They're all back open. Salama po for tuning in. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And all who have, God bless.